Now this, a video getting a lot of attention from parents and now even law enforcement. A coach allegedly bending back the hands of the players who beat his team. Xavier Walton joins us after talking to the parent of one of these children. Xavier. This video really is sparking strong mixed reaction, both against and in support of this former coach in question. But you're about to hear from the father of one of the players who is worried about his son being targeted. So he asked us to hide his identity so he could share his story. That coach pulled me back. When this dad saw the video on Saturday, he was mad. His son was in that line. He should be ashamed of himself or whatever, whatever he did. The now former coach in a blue shirt and khaki shorts appeared to be overly aggressive in the handshake line at Baseball USA in West Houston. Moments later, you can hear the players reacting. Ah, oh, oh, that kid hit me hard. He allegedly bent their hands back instead of giving simple high fives. Later that day, when being asked to leave by Baseball USA, the father recalls this. It seemed like he didn't care that day because he, he even said that he was a cop. Go ahead and do whatever you, you want to do. They can't do nothing to me because I'm a cop. He said that? Yeah, he said that. The former coach, Kenneth Went, is a sergeant with the Harris County Constable Precinct 5 office. Precinct 5 sent KHOU this statement saying it is aware of the video the Houston Police Department is investigating and it's being reviewed by the Harris County District Attorney's Office. The sergeant involved in the allegations has been relieved of duty pending the outcome. Okay, okay. A parent from the team in white who was at the game as well is standing up for the former coach saying he spends an extraordinary amount of time in coaching and helping kids and their families both on and off the field. But this parent from the team in gold, he went out there and tried to try to hurt him, says he shouldn't work with kids and he should get punched for what he did. Xavier Walton, KHOU 11 News.